Now I'm going to discuss Scrabble and discuss its history. Scrabble, a board and tile game in which two or four players compete in forming words with letter tiles on a 225 square board. Words spelled out by letters on the tiles interlock with words in a crossword puzzle. Players draw seven tiles from a pool at the start and replenish their supply after each return. Tiles in the pool and those of the players are kept secret so the other player can see only those tiles on the board and his own. A player may forfeit his turn and exchange any or all of these tiles for those in the pool and there are 100 letters each tiles and each are print imprinted with a point value of 4 different letters. Approximately corresponding to the frequency of the occurrence of the letters in English words. Words are scored by adding up the point values of the letters multiplied by any of 61 premium squares that may be covered, such as double letter, triple letter, double word, and triple word. Scoring as the game advances is possible both horizontally and vertically, with higher scores registered by forming two or more interla interlocking words at the same time. At the end of the game, when one player has no tiles or the board is deadlocked, the player who has scored the greatest number of points is the winner. Values of unused letters left to the players are totaled and deducted from their scores. Originally, it is called crisscross the game, which was based on the crossword puzzle and anagrams, and was developed by Alfred M. Botts, an architect in 1931. It was designed, renamed as Scrabble, and marked by James Brownot in, in 1948. It was first sold in Great Britain in 1954.